Hello, I'm Mr Craven from the NET Director Team, and I'm going to be talking you through the narrative of William Shakespeare's Romeo and Juliet. The play begins with a fight between the servants of the Montagues and the Capulets. Benvolio Montague and Tybalt Capulet also get involved. The prince tells the families that if they ever fight again, he will have them killed. Paris, a young nobleman, wishes to marry Capulet's daughter, Juliet, and Capulet invites him to a feast he is holding in order to meet her. Juliet has never thought about marriage, but she's willing to see what she thinks of Paris. Romeo, Lord Montague's son, is depressed. He's in love with Rosaline, but she has no interest in him. Romeo's cousin, Benvolio, and his friend, Mercutio, the prince's cousin, help Romeo gatecrash the Capulet feast in order to cheer him up. At the feast, Romeo and Juliet fall instantly in love, only then realising who they actually are. Tybalt spots Romeo and swears revenge. Romeo and Juliet meet secretly after the feast. They declare their love and they promise to marry. Romeo persuades Friar Lawrence to marry them the next day. The friar agrees, hoping to stop the violence between the families. Juliet's nurse makes the arrangements. After the wedding, Romeo and his friends are confronted by Tybalt, who is still angry about the party. Romeo refuses to fight, but Mercutio intervenes and dies, stabbed by Tybalt and cursing both families. Romeo, distraught, kills Tybalt and then flees the scene. The prince, furious about the fighting and that his cousin has been killed, banishes Romeo. Romeo and Juliet meet secretly for their wedding night. She forgives him for killing her cousin. Romeo leaves in the morning for Mantua to wait things out. Capulet, trying to cheer Juliet up, arranges her wedding to Paris. Juliet, unable to admit the truth, refuses, but she's overruled. She turns to Friar Lawrence for help, and he gives her a drug to fake her death, sending a letter to Romeo to inform him of the plan. It doesn't arrive. Juliet is buried in the Capulet family tomb. Romeo, hearing of her death, heads to the tomb to kill himself. On the way, he's confronted by Paris. They fight, and Paris is killed. Romeo finds Juliet's body and kills himself. Juliet wakes up, finds Romeo dead, and kills herself as well. The prince reprimands both families. All are punished. Capulet and Montague finally make peace.